This is Nadia from the Cognito Forms team. In this video, we're going to learn how to use the Form Preview window on the Build page. The Form Preview allows you to test out different functions on your form, like calculations, conditional logic, and payment. You can also perform workflow actions to move your form through different statuses and compare role-based views. To get started, open your form and select the Preview button at the bottom of the Build page. Here, you can perform various actions on your form without creating new entries, processing payments, or sending email notifications. Starting from the bottom left, toggle the validation option off to bypass field requirements, such as required input or formatting criteria. This option is especially useful if you have a multi-page form, so you can navigate through the pages without filling in every required field. Next, click on a status name to directly view your form as it exists within that status. In this example, changing the status to Approved causes the action buttons to disappear just as they would on the actual form. Next to the status option, select a role name to view your form as seen by that role. For example, changing the role from Employee to Accounting allows us to submit payments or update the form. Speaking of payments, you can test the payment functionality without needing to enter credit card details. The best way to do this is with validation toggled off, which will allow you to submit a payment while leaving the credit card fields blank. However, if you prefer to leave validation toggled on, you can still submit the form with credit card details without charging the card. The preview version of your form doesn't create new entries and therefore won't process any payments. Using a combination of these options, you can test your form and walk through your entire workflow from start to finish. As you test workflow actions, a reset icon will appear at the bottom of the window. Click this icon to reset your preview from the previous action you performed. If you have questions about anything mentioned in this video or would like to learn more about Cognito Forms, be sure to check out our help guides.